Cold calling is one of the best way, if not the best way to get client in your social media agency or whichever other agency you go. But listen carefully in this video because I do want to go and explain to you what mistakes you should avoid because there's a lot of mistakes. You're calling somebody and within the first five to 10 seconds of the phone call, this person will understand whether you're a scam, whether you want to sell something or whether you want to give a real, real service with a real offer. So take your pen out, take your notepad out, read and listen carefully and also write down all the points. And with that said, we start immediately. But if you do enjoy this type of video, please consider subscribing. We are 33 subscribers to 40 subscribers and let's get this video to 20 likes. But with that said, guys, first point that you need to write down is to not be spammy. Now. How do I start a phone call? How do I start a cold call for my agency? Well, the first thing that you need to say is to go straight to the point. You do not want to go and play around with your audience. You do not want to go and play around with your potential client. So the first thing that I say when I call call is like, hello, my name is Lorenzo. I am calling you to offer you my service. I'm a social media marketing manager. I'm a social media manager, whatever. I give them the possibility that, hello, this, uh, I'm Lorenzo. I'm calling you to sell you, not to sell you, but I'm calling you to offer my service for your business. And I would like to know if you have 30 seconds or one minute of your time so that we can talk about it and you're able to evaluate and ask me any question. If you're not interested, we can hang the phone out right now. Very important to give them the option. You do not want to go and insist. You don't want to go and be heavy on them you give them the option i am calling you not to book an appointment not for anything straight and forward i want to offer you this and i would like to know if you are interested also on the first line that you say after you present yourself you say who you are when you say i would like to offer you my service and i do offer a one month free trial or i do offer 15 coming back clients 15 signups 15 new clients if not you're not going to pay me so at the beginning, put them to the opportunity that you're like, hello, I am offering you this and this is what I guarantee. Of course, any business will like, oh, 50 new clients sounds very nice. 20 new clients sounds very nice. Very, very important to give it the opportunity like that. If you just call them and say, hey, my name is Lorenzo. I'm calling you. I'm a social media manager and I want to give you my service. They could be a little bit like, no, thank you. We do not want it because if they do want it, they will go and look at it for themselves. So give them the opportunity to say Yes or no, depending on the offer that you give them. 50 new clients or you don't pay me. Two months for free. The first month for free. Whatever it could be. Come up with an idea. Let me know in the comments down below your free trial, your idea to catch clients. A lot of the time it works that basically they work. You work for free for them until you give them X amount of client, which is, okay, I will only pay you if the job is done properly and if there is job coming in, seems about right. I will pay you a grand a month if you take me 20 clients that in total they can generate $25,000, example. So it is very, very important to put it in that perspective to give them at the beginning the idea and the mental stimulus to say, oh, he doesn't want to take my money. He wants to offer his job. He doesn't want to grab the money and run. First he works, then he gets the money. At this point, they'll be, they'll be able to say, yes or no if they say no okay don't worry have their email have their phone number saved in a spreadsheet in a google sheet in a note whatever if they say yes what happens now listen carefully and watch until the end because there's some nice and important tips that you need to understand very very carefully now what happens if they say yes at this point you need to go and explain your service so keep it short keep it brief because then you can catch them more for a follow-up voice call face email meaning that you're able to go and call them on skype on zoom anywhere on whatsapp video call wherever you're able to go and give a name to the face or to the voice that you're talking to so you explain them briefly and you said as i mentioned before i work by my own i work in an agency whatever you want to call it in my agency and i offer this program i we are specialized in either dentist if you're talking to a dentist ballet school if you're talking to a ballet school guitar lesson if you're talking to a guitar lesson so you understand you need to say that you're specialized in the field that you're calling and you do offer a money back guarantee if the job is not done what does this mean well that you do the first month basically for free and if you are good if you know that you can make it then you can tell them that, hey, I'm giving you 15 new clients. After the 50th client, at the 15th client, you will pay me. And from there on, it starts the working relationship. So basically, it is a free month, but within a month, with the advertisement and everything, you will be bringing new clients. 
and it is very important that you do bring new clients because then the payment will start or you say i want to work for you and this is what we offer after the 50th clients we will start to get paid monthly or weekly whatever you want to get paid it's up to you so very important that you do set it in this way that you offer them the possibility or you have a free month for free and you test it out you let me know how it works if then you do like our service we will do a three months collaboration, a four months, you know, period, whatever it is can be. But give them the opportunity, explain that, emphasize it a bit more, and then explain to them what they will ask them. For example, what are you looking for? What are you, how, where do you want to have big, better sales? Where do you want to have more leads? And so on. You explain that you take leads and how you're going to follow up with the leads, uh, you know, when they save, when they come in, that you can contact them or they can contact them. You can just take all the clients and they will do all the contacting in case they have a secretary. If they're not already a, you know, a sole person in the business that they could need your help, you can also offer that to increase the paycheck. So this is the number two. The step number two, very important. You explain them and you give them the possibility to understand that if you do not work, if you do not make them money, they will not pay you. So you will have to make the money. You will have to make them come some profit. After that, you will get paid on a monthly basis. Unnecessary of what the second month and the third month, very important. You cannot be like, yeah, every month I need to take a minimum of 15 clients. After the first 15, 10, 20 clients, whatever you decide to be, after that, you get the first paycheck and every month after the first paycheck, you get paid. It doesn't matter how many clients the first month work. They need to understand that the second can work, the third can work and so on. Very important that you put that into perspective. First step and second step we cover. The third step is to go and book a video call, a Zoom call, a meeting so that if it's not in your local area, if not, go and talk to them, you know, go and talk to them directly, privately, go and tell them, oh, we can meet, you're close to where we are. I can come in for a interview for so to say, or just you can go and have a chat with them. If not, go and have a Zoom meeting with them, give a face to the people that you're talking to so that they also understand who you are, they see you, they feel a bit more comfortable, which I I think it's very very important and in the zoom call you go into details of everything how do you find the client how do you do the list call you explain to them that facebook and ads you know those campaigns are paid by them there is an extra extra money on top of what is going to be paid by the ad how you're going to find clients what's your way if you're going to contact these new leads What's the way that you're going to interact with them? How you're going to call them? How you're going to message them? If you offer a discount in the advertisement, for example, book three and get two for free. So you have a five sessions in total. How are you going to explore them? How are you going to get them convinced to sign the first three emails or even how are you going to get new leads? So the new leads, you're able to get them by setting up, uh, you know, free course if you're booking a month of work or, you know, free whitening teeth if you book three whitening teeth. So you understand what I mean? You give them the opportunity to understand what your work ethic, your work method, the way for you to get the new client is. And this is going to be discounts, it's going to be free session, it's going to be whatever comes to your mind. Of course, talk to them and say, this is my idea. I would like to know what you think about it. And if so, or if it is not sustainable for your business or you would like something different or even better, if you could add something more into it, something better, let me know. We discuss together and then we put the plan out. Very important that you do be friendly with them, that you are understanding that potentially you are somebody new in their business. Maybe this is their baby. They just launched it or they launched it five years ago, but it's only so only built them. And now it is 2023, 2022, end of 2022. So they need some new social media guide. They need to push on social media because you cannot do without it. So understand that it could be a little bit scary for them. Do not give them the possibility to tell you, oh, this you should do it. You should do it. But give them the idea. Give them the incentivization to be like, what do you think is best? Where do you see luck? Ask them question give them possibility to tell you how to how they've been running it so far and where you can step in and give the new you know this job this new business some new clients some new ideas so very very important that you are open minded to it and after that you start pushing so there's three key you know moments in a phone call the first one the introduction you tell them in a brief one minute chat if you have one minute extra if you go five minutes i can explain you more but you tell them there's money back guarantee there's x amount of clients that are going to come in what's your name what do you do and ask them if they got time without sounding like a spam very important at the second stage of the phone call what do you do the second stage of the phone call you are going to explain them in details how everything works ask them questions tell them what is going to happen 
and then on the third stage you move to the final and potentially the most important which is going to be the zoom call or the video call whatever platform you want to use and explain even better get to know each other tell them how the facebook ads run how the uh, you know marketing how the payment is going to be set up and so on and so on so very very important but i do hope you did enjoy today's video let me know down in the comments below your thoughts leave a like subscribe to the channel if you are new and i will see you all in the next video ciao guys